again, boys and girls. How are you? Well, here I am again. And this time we're making something else for that holiday, Thanksgiving. Something fun that you can wear tomorrow and on your actual Thanksgiving day that you celebrate with your families. First, you need these materials. You can find them in your last materials envelope. Should we put something like this paper clip together? We have a brown piece of construction paper. We have this little red paper with a, it's going to be part of a turkey. Turkey parts, orange, a white piece. We've got a sentence strip have to be orange and we have some other turkey parts you should have three different colors let's get started now I have all of my pieces out here first things first let's sort these are the things that you'll need to cut this one I'm gonna put on top because we're gonna do something first. I'm gonna set these aside. Now, take out this white piece. These are going to be the turkey eyes. Yes, we're making a turkey gobble gobble hat. So fun. So, you can get a Sharpie or a marker or crayon and draw your silly eyes. Now you can make silly turkey eyes you can put them in the middle, put them one on top. I think I'm gonna make stilly eyes. So you can either trace before you decide, that way you can erase. Do I want my eyes to look like that? Mm, I don't know. Let me see, let me draw them in the middle. I like that, one silly eye, one in the middle. So I'm gonna trace around that. And then I'm gonna color that in. I'm not gonna color it in with Sharpie though, cause that's not a good coloring tool. So I'm gonna use my crayons. Okay, there are my silly eyeballs. Now, time for cutting. Set my crayons aside. I've got all my little things that I need to cut. And I am going to cut on that dark line. And when you cut, on curved lines. Remember, you have to turn the paper with the other hand and do, and when you get to those little tiny spaces, you do teeny tiny cuts. Be careful of your fingers, turn the paper. So little up and down cuts give you more control to stay on that line. We can use big cuts on straight lines and smaller cuts on curved lines. There we go. There are my googly eyes. Let me show you what I mean by straight. Now look at the straight line. This one I can do big up and down strokes. Be careful of your fingers. Turn the paper. And there, I've got that beak. Got my eyes and my beak. I'm going to cut all of these other things. Now, pay attention to these feathers. These are gonna be the feathers. Notice the, how there's dark lines in here. Do not cut on the inner lines on the inside of that feather. You're gonna cut along the outside line. So I can do my big cuts on the straight line. I'm gonna go past those inside lines and do my little cuts on the curvy parts and my bigger cuts on the straight parts. Okay, I'm gonna do that with all of the other feathers and cut my other things out. You can pause the video now and do your cutting and come back when you're finished with all of your cutting. Oops, sometimes we make mistakes. I accidentally cut it cut on the wrong line. So you know what? Easy fix. I'm gonna show you how. We're just, I'm just gonna continue to cut this part out. 
little, just little, little cuts. And if you have some tape, you can just tape that back together. Ask an adult to help you. Okay, I taped it, see that? Is it okay to make mistakes? Of course, it's okay. Sometimes we can fix our mistakes. Sometimes we just have to start over. Sometimes it's just okay to have a boo-boo. All right, I've got to clean all of this up and I will be right back with the next steps. Okay, now here comes the planning. I'm thinking that my turkey will look something like this but we can always position the eyes a little crooked, beak a little crooked. So this is a little waddle that goes underneath. So I'm gonna look at my plan. Now notice that my some of my things are overlapping. See that? So I have to decide what I'm going to glue first. So this one, this goes on top of the waddle so you don't see that point. So I'm gonna glue this first. Then my eyes and then I can place this beak where I want it. Unless I want it under his eyeball, but I, I don't know. I think I like that better. What do you think? Yes. There's one more thing that I noticed. This is the strip of paper that's gonna fit around your head. So we're gonna be gluing this brown paper to this strip, just like we did the spider hat. But my paper is a little too big, so I am going to measure and cut. So I'm gonna line up my two papers on the edges like this, hold it down with one hand. And it's okay if you go above the line, if you wanna make it a little bit taller, like that. And then I'm just gonna trace along. Ooh, my pencil's breaking. Now I can see a light pencil line there, and I'm going to cut in a straight line by big cutting strokes. There. And now I've got that on. We're gonna glue on top of this paper. Hmm, no, we're not. We're gonna glue these feathers behind the paper. Actually, I might just do this. Okay, see how I have to think about these things? I think I'm gonna glue this to this strip first. And remember, I'm gonna line it up so there's space here and space here. So I'm gonna glue that first, so make sure you get your glue stick out and meet me back here. Okay, so. One of the materials you'll need, obviously, is your glue stick. So here's my glue stick. Remember, you don't need to roll it up all the way, just a little bit. And I wanted to mention that if you happen to have more construction feathers, you can always trace out more colors if you'd like and add more feathers. You only have three here, but we know that turkeys have more than just three feathers. So if you wanna add on, that is up to you. All right, so I'm just going to Add some glue. It doesn't have to be all over. Close my glue cap, put the cap on, turn it over, glue it to the sentence strip here. Making sure that the whole sentence strip doesn't show except for on the sides here. Okay, next step. I remember what I said I was gonna glue first. The waddle and then the eyes. And then the beak. That's my plan. Okay, first the waddle. Notice that it's sticking out a little bit, so I don't need to put glue on that part that's hanging down. 
I just need to put a little, and then notice that I'm doing the side that has the black line, so you don't see that black line. And I'm gonna, there my eyes go there, my waddle goes right about there. Now do I want my eyes on top? Oh, I think so. Yeah. All right, so I'm gonna glue my I like it a little crooked. Silly turkey. And notice that my eyes are sticking up. So I only need glue right above the beak. This time I'm just gonna do direct do it directly on the brown paper at the top. And set the eyes where I want it. Alright, that's gonna dry. Now we don't want our feathers to be sticking on top like this, right? It has to go behind. So you are going to have to turn your paper around, eyeballs on top, lines are upside down so you don't see them. Well, this is the part we're not gonna see. Place those feathers where you want them. And if you have more feathers, you'll want it to kind of look like a rainbow. We only have three, so I'm gonna put one here, and it's kind of like a rainbow angled. Well, it's up to you. You can put them straight up if you'd want. It's your hat. You decide. And notice that I do not need glue up here. So I'm only gonna use glue where I'm gonna put the feathers. So I'm gonna put three spots. one in the middle and notice they're upside down you don't see that part right now voila there's my turkey hat now i'm gonna let that dry before i measure my head and put it on and then we can use a stapler or glue or tape to make a hat Okay, my turkey is dry. I am ready to put it on my head. I'm so excited. Uh-oh, my feather's falling. I may need to add some more glue. But let me show you how I measure it. I just put it around my head and you might need someone to help you. I put it just like that I, where I want it. I hold it together. And I can either glue this down, staple it, or tape it. I'm going to use a stapler. And I'm test it again. Yay! Gobble, gobble! You know what? I can even... Oh, you know why it's falling? Because I didn't glue it to the eyes. I need to glue it to the eyes. I'm gonna staple it. You can also staple. It just won't look as pretty. <laughs> there we go. Gobble, gobble. Happy Turkey Day, happy Thanksgiving. I am thankful for you. All of your teachers are thankful for you. I hope you enjoy this wonderful holiday season. See you later, boys and girls.